So I want to illustrate how these flotility transitions work. These flotility transitions work on a slide, not between slides. So we're going to start with this particular slide in Keynote 6.2. Uh, we have a book here, but there are actually three elements on this slide. If I click outside the book, boom, you can now see this symbol here, of course, which tells us that we have a movie, but it's transparent. The movie occupies the whole of this slide, judging by these, uh, the points where we can actually change the size of the slide. Okay, But there are three elements. So if I click outside the box, we are left with the other ones. But anyway, if I click anywhere, it's all, we've got these middle element here, and I'm going to drag it away. And you can see here, hiding behind the first element is the second element. So what's going to happen is that this slide is going to transit from this to then showing just this. So let me recenter this in the center. You've got these lovely guides that will help you when they're two. There we are. So now we know it's in the center. Click outside here. And we can actually watch it in preview here, what's going to look like. Okay. So that's what the actual transition movie is. You can, I'll do it again. There we go. But what we want to do is when the elements close, we want this image to disappear. So let's have a look at the build. This first build here, called Flotility, is the movie. And it's going to start when I click it. The second build, which is this image that I've created, is going to disappear 0.6 seconds after the Flotility movie starts. The other image that's hiding behind it doesn't have to do anything, because this is simply going to disappear. If we had another image, that was bigger than this one, then we'd have to use a third build and that would build in at the same time that this one builds out. Okay, now why is it 0.6 seconds? Why have I delayed it six seconds? Well, each of the flotility movies completely covers the slide and that's where, like a magician, you're going to make this disappear and the other one appear. Okay, so if we go to movie over here, move this out the way for a moment down to here you can see the movie in the trim section goes from here and it lasts 1.4 seconds okay 1.4 seconds so if, let me just move this down to where it closes boom and let's move it from here to when it actually operates boom so the movie, this area here is actually staying closed in here between these two, between 0.533 seconds and 0.848 seconds. That's the time in which this is closed and we can change it over. Okay. And we can change it over. And that's why this one disappears at 0.6 seconds. So if we do a little um, preview, of this uh, show. Let's have a look and see what it looks like. And now we're left with the image that we wanted, which is great. But you must have the movie in front. You must have the movie in front. Otherwise, it doesn't cover the screen. So let me show you what happens if we move the movie to the back and you can see here, it can't go any further forward because the, these are grayed out. It can only go backwards. And so we're going to send it all the way to the back, which is where it is now. And then we're going to play it. And then you're going to see what it actually looks like if it's from the back. Watch. So you can see at some point, we change from the front image to the back image. Let's do it again. Bring it all the way to the front and we'll play it again. Okay, and that's kind of how this works. And each different movie, in fact, will have a different timing. So if I change this one, which is a flash, you'll see here it actually lasts 1.5 seconds 
And if we find out when does the flash begin, it begins there, but we can still see the image. It's completely obliterated here at 0.411, but this is where you want to take it when the, when the screen goes completely white. Let's grab it down here and just see when it ends. So we've only got a very limited time before it ends, like 0.504, okay? 0.504. So let's un untrim it. And in this case, the disappear will come through I'll do it at 0.55. I'll do a preview. That looks good. Okay. So let's play it and see what happens. And that's just what we wanted.